friends in the last lecture we discussed about the software installation and download and pre requirement in this lecture we will discuss how to create new project if you see in right hand side in android studio android studio version 2.2 Start a new Android Studio project. Open an existing Android Studio project. If you have any, if you have an old Android Studio project, you just click on existing project. You can open and import also. Check our project from the version control. This thing we will discuss later. And import an Android code sample. If you click on import an Android code sample, some of the sample applications are provided by the Google. You can direct import, yeah, you can use, yeah, you can get an idea from these all the codes. You see here the lot of code, a yeah, lot of sample application is provided by the Google. You can easily get the idea from all these apps. This yeah, is stress cancelling. Now, we are starting a new project. Click start a new Android Studio project. If you start, click, you will get some options here in the first screen. First application name, company domain, something like this. What is the application name? Application name means if you download the WhatsApp, you see the WhatsApp. This is the application name. Now we are using our first step. First app. What is the company domain and what is the package name? Simple. If you just click on any other, type the Play Store, Google Play Store. In browser open any other app just like as I open Instagram he see com dot snigda dot Instagram this is package name this is company domain is a unique identification for your application unique identification for your application now we are also keeping one unique identification for application. First app you can say com domain com dot my first app, whatever. First app. Package name also same. Yeah, you can change the package name also. Fourth thing's main is where you want to store your project code where you want to store this directory so we are going in documents we just create here folder android you want to store all the things in android just copy paste if you are the mac user copy the android as a path name control v Android document get the Android this is your app name first app in document directory Android folder and app name is the first app next click in next click if you see here lot of options select the form factor your app will run on different platforms may require separate SDK phone and tablets wear Android wear devices means phone and tablets everyone are the familiar with the uh, phone and tablets Android wear devices means Android watch we can say TV means present times the TV same like as this in uh, 20 inch 30 inch yeah 15 inch like TV Android TV also available Android laptop also available Android auto and the glass now we are discussing phone and tablets app 
Later, we'll discuss all the things. All are the same functional related. Phone and tablets, minimum SDK. What is the meaning of minimum SDK? If you lower C, lower API level target more devices but have the few, fewer features available. By targeting API 15 and later, your app will run approximately 97.4% of the devices that are active on the Google Play Store. Means 97.4% of devices will support your app. If you select any other 4.3 yeah if you select 4.0 the ratio will change you can see 3.2 I am selecting 4.0.3 reason is Android material design supports from the 4.0.3 Now click on the next. In next window, if you see, lot of by default application framework, lot of by default application structure they are giving. Add no activity, basic activity, empty activity, full screen activity, Google uh, add more ads activity, Google map activity, login activity, master details, navigation, lot of all are this. We are selecting just empty activity. If you practice with the empty activity, we will get the more idea, we will get the more logic about the, the app creation and app development. After learning, we can select any other. We will discuss one by one all the things, all the by default framework, all this. Now we are selecting the empty activity. Next thing, if you see, it asking about the some activity name and the layout name. We selected empty activity. By default, Android provide one Java class and one XML class, one XML layout. What is difference between the Java class and the XML layout? We can say like that. Java class for the functionality handle lesson. An XML class for the UI layout activity main. Later we'll de in details later we'll discuss about layout and the activity. Just we are clicking on finish. It will take some time. Hardly is the um, ten seconds. It's depend on your uh, RAM. If your RAM is the eight GB and something like this, it more fast. If you see, you read line, Gradle building configuration projects, uh, config, configure project, resolve dependencies, lot of things are the building in backend. Now we are closing here. In next section, next lecture we will discuss about the other things. Thank you for watching video. Please subscribe my channel.